got a show. Eight tour yeah, dates. We got a show in like a few hours. Yeah. I'm really just trying to get this van and get on my way. Please. I'm feeling super good, man. I'm feeling like the tour is finally about to get going. And I'm just trying to like grasp the moment in my head, like how everything is going to be. Josh was waiting on Dom to make it because Dom was late. They had, what, two minutes to get on the plane? He had Dom's ticket. I remember thinking, fuck Dom Beats. You were late to the airport, and I couldn't get a sausage McMuffin. Dom being late to the airport could be the first of many fuck ups. We'll see. Out here, bro. I'm about to land and shit. I need you to get straight to the point. You feel me? H-Town, we just landed PNC XX tour. You already know what it is. Becoming strong. So as soon as we land, I'm just trying to make sure like hotels are straight, rentals are straight, venues are straight. It's been so many challenges. The last couple of times we've had like a, a strong anchor really like show us the ropes. Now this is like our first foray. I'm the tour manager. I'm just hoping we have a successful tour. My crib, my crib, me and you, me and you. So many things, so many things. We can do. Casey gets on the phone, he has a lot of family in Texas. He calls up his cousin Shantae. She told me she wants to give me a nice southern cooked meal. Hold on, do not take a picture of me. I am not getting ready. We got the yams, we got the mic, we got the bread, we got the chicken mixed up with that rice. I'm gonna get down on this LA style tilapia where it's gonna melt in your mouth. Wait till it come out the oven when you see that steam. Uh -huh. Look at this beautiful thing. And then after I make the corn bread, I'm gonna fry some chicken and bacon. Yeah. Cause I got some chicken and bacon. Pulls out deer meat that she actually killed and made herself into sausage. She's like, yeah, you gonna help me cook this deer meat. I was like, I'm about to do what? Deer meat, let's go. There you go. Welcome to H-Town, baby. Came back to the city, yeah, thing popping. Same girl, wait for me. Hey, we're going to South Check. We gotta do that meet and greet, though. Yeah, gotta do it. I don't think we're going to South Check. The sound check at 3 30. So we gotta go right now, huh? I'll take that task, I'll say that staff, rock that show, I'll make that stack. Still won't see as far as I just go. It's young CB with the capital. You won't be a capital. Spit that, spit that shit. We got you, yeah, yeah. As I put my pen to the paper, the influence is great on my thoughts, so rushing fast, I'm doing this world a favor, because half of the things I think never ever get said, but anybody who did, they probably ended up dead. They got me thinking this world is headed straight for destruction. Lies of these politicians, they talk but never do nothing. They saying it for the people, but gave the people the needles. They treating us like we nothing. They're crushing us like we Beatles. Yeah, you 21? You From out here in H-Town? Yes, sir. Uh, 100. Swear, swear. I just wanted to do a like, small show for my fans. That's about it. That's about it. Travis Scott is a biatch. A biatch. A B-I-T-C-H. I'm gonna give you the B-I-T-C-H. What's up with you in the next store? They're like, what are you doing? You know, you ain't talking to nobody at the store or something like niggas. I don't have no contact with the people. I'm a sad job. Josh P, he's like one of those guys that you can't live with, can't live without. I'm doing business and just trying to make stuff happen. We have like those personalities that kind of conflict. We got something like, is it people at the in-store? I'm not sure, I'm not there yet. I'm like, nigga, you better find out. I didn't go to the in-store because uh, I was renting the van. It was a whole issue, a whole ordeal. She home me where people be burning trash, rolling by, feeling hella good. I've been up in Inglewood. Basically, you just need someone with a, with a valid credit card and driver's license. Over 25. I'm not 25. No one in our crew is 25. Our driver is of age, but he wasn't on our business card. We always kind of point the finger at Josh P because we feel like he's the one that should have it all taken care of. I guess I told Josh we was coming after, so maybe he told him that, and maybe they didn't get it set up because they felt like we was coming after. We are. Yeah, that's the one thing about tours, always something that can hold you back, but you just got to keep on pushing through. Feel good to be back, man. It definitely bugs me out sometimes that uh, them kids are out there lined up, you know what I'm saying, patiently to meet me, because for me to like line up to meet somebody, I would have to really appreciate them. Nothing better than getting love from your people. You know what, what up, bro? You good? You good? You good? You the most famous person I've ever met, man. Most what? The most famous person I've ever met. You think so? Yeah, for real. I'm not that famous. Yeah, just, you know what I'm saying? Fan. I'm a cool amount of fans. Yeah, man. That shirt is hard, though. Yeah, appreciate it. What kind of shirt is that? In store is very important. It's more private. It's more closed off. It's not like all these damn kids trying to rush you. Actually get a time to ask you questions, get a signed CD, get a photo. 
It's an intimate thing. Okay, how are you? My name is Claire Vogel. I'm one half of Scoremore. Scoremore has always been a dope touring company. We've been working with Casey for like three years now. He's just like a young kid, like really killing the game. He's building it the right way. So as a promoter, that's really what attracted me. When I came, man, I gotta come show love. I wasn't expecting this many people. What time is it? Seven. 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 Where the fuck is Josh? So, Josh at the shit still about to yeah. get We finally put someone of age on our corporate card and they're still having trouble, so it's like, fuck. I'm really at my wood's end with this shit, period. Who knows if we're gonna hit traffic? Who knows? I don't know at this point. Nothing, you can't ask me questions. I don't know nothing. We missed shows before. It's stressful, like it is. It's anxiety in the pit of my stomach, me having to be the manager. Like, I, I feel that shit a lot. I got a show. Tour we got a show in like a few hours. Yeah. I'm really just trying to get this van and get on my way. We kind of expect more out of them. I expect more out of them. Acting like everything was, oh yeah, they ready. They ready for them to come get it. They ready, they ready. But no, we're not ready. They have to use a major credit card to debit cards and it's not working. That's the problem, the policy. No, I get it, but it's just like, you, under, you understand I'm committed, I'm gonna, we're gonna pay it. It's not, the, the money doesn't, it's not affect the profit. We're not trying to run no scams, we have two cards on the account. I thought everything was taken care of, I thought we were just about to get over here, everything was smooth sailing. It was like the Hail Mary, I had to call in like the, the troops. I appreciate that so much. You're the man, bro. Damn, you said do it. Serious. Keep talking to him. Danny said do it. Through the bomb with Danny Lee, our executive producer here. So we use his card. We got the rental. Everything's okay. It's okay. Me you gotta lotion up, you know what I'm saying? I gotta keep it fresh with the leg on play. <laughs> I can't do the rapper talk like, hey, you know what it is, he out in the H town, you know what I'm saying? How at you, boy, you know, we got the view, we got the show, about to turn this shit up, man, we ain't about to play with y'all, man, we been playing for a long time. Before the show, the little butterflies, but those are always good, though. I always just try to get in my own zone, just... For the city, I'm like, I want to really kill it. It's more pressure on me, definitely just to make sure it's a successful tour. It's different when you're opening and when you're doing your own show. Like, the draw is all me. stage with Casey. I don't think I'm on stage just having a good time. That's his anxiety relief. It's a different person. I wanted to make sure that we performed a couple new songs that I had in the stash. I felt like, you know what I'm saying, people needed to start getting familiar with it. The new songs we usually do are always like the liveest songs, like his new party anthem that we got. People's first time hearing music, you can see how they really, truly react to a song. Hey, the noise y'all Look, this is produced by the homie Hit Boy. Keep turning that up, sound man. Keep that loud, little bit. Hey, hey, hey. Everybody talking when they get in contributions. I'm not sure I'm ready. She get in contributions. We get to stay in music. She get to stay in the drinks. I pull us two balls and I got to try to make this thing. She get us to one pop. Got a great response. Your action was crazy. Like, when you're seeing people tweeting about the new songs, being here for the new songs, and like asking for the new shit to be dropped, and I was like, okay, like, that was really the confirmation. It's my first real show in the H now, and I really appreciate y'all for coming out. So crazy, it's packed in there. I go hard every night. First shows is dope. They always like fun. It was good energy all the way through. We out here in the H Town. Mr. Get Any Girl Number behind me just chilling. Turn up. But what I know, Casey, man, it's really good. Uh, the peas and carrots. When I used to run my boutique back in the day, I always wanted to pick up the brand, but I wasn't cool to figure out how to get the brand from him. So it was always something we admired. Like, damn, much respect, man. Respect. It's not but love or whatever. I like to see people just make it.
definitely glad I'm at Houston the first day just because it's Houston, Texas. Like, that's a great city, period. Culture all over that city. Houston came correct for sure, for sure, man. Jump off the PNCX tour in a great way. Pure success. Back on this road trip. Yo, what it is, it's your boy, KC Vengeance. If you want to cop the official Road Trip t-shirt, make sure y'all click here.